Well, the day has finally come. We're standing in a finished, beautiful remodel of a classic home in Terrell Hills. This client came to us and she was so fun and exciting. And the house is a historical home that is already amazing. When they came to us, we knew we were gonna have to match that energy throughout the entire remodel. And you'll see, we accomplished that. We are the fourth owners of this house. And it was, it's a beautiful house. It's a Texas shotgun style house, but it needed some help, it needed some love. My vision was to create a place for family, and we wanted to stick with the period of the house. This home was built in Terrell Hills in 1896. It was moved to this location from downtown San Antonio in 1965. So naturally we were very excited to work on a home with such character and history. But of course it had some challenges. Some of the things that we overcame were the compartmentalization of a home of this age. We wanted to stay true to the architecture and to the style of the home and didn't have to bump out the walls that we would normally do. So by opening it up with glass doors, a couple of them, and multiple windows, we brought the light in and we brought the beautiful scenery from the patio and pool. There was another need that we had addressed that the homeowner wanted, and that had to do with having a powder bath. This home had been built in sections, uh, the original section then had an addition, but it never had a guest bath that was separate from the bedrooms. And then the bathroom goes in here. Mm -hmm. So a little powder bath in there. We just took a tour of the house. There's no bathroom that's not connected to a bedroom. So that's, that's right. why it was important for them to be able to have like when they're hosting, they can have a designated party bath or a powder bath. So the solution was to put a nice powder bath right off the drawing room, which is just off the kitchen, gives it the privacy and separation from the main entertaining areas of the home. Some of the other challenges that we faced were many things out of level, out of plumb, and that's just normal, but there's always some surprise. One of the walls that we thought was not weight bearing was indeed weight bearing because the home had stopped on that wall originally. So we had to put extra beams up in the attic to carry those loads. And again, keeping true to the character of the home, we enjoyed working on the multi-step crown moldings that were in the home and matching those up seamlessly. You cannot tell where we stopped and started. That's always something that we're proud of. Another one had to do with the original long leaf yellow pine floors that were in this home. It was beautiful, it had its own character, but we needed to figure out how to join that seamlessly and still create some real interest in this room. So we did a herringbone pattern of the same long leaf yellow pine in the kitchen. And once everything was incorporated and installed, it looked perfect. It draws just the right amount of attention, I think, to the floors, but not overpowering in the room. And it again is a statement of the past. One thing that we always try to do in the design phase with our clients is ask them how not only they want to feel in the new space, but also how they want their whole house to feel, including the new space. We love cooking and we love having friends and family come visit. Ever since I was a kid, we would get together and we would talk about our day. And the kitchen was the spirit of the home. So that is why we did what we did. With such an old home, like Dad mentioned before, it's a very compartmentalized home. 
but a really cool feature is all of the rooms in this house are really awesomely styled and decorated and made for entertaining. So we wanted this new kitchen to complement those spaces. So because of that, we were able to make this a true kitchen. So we used the space and we gave them this gorgeous 10 foot island. Yeah, so it's gonna be an oversized, we're using a jumbo slab island this way. We rearranged it to where when they're cooking, they're facing another feature of the home, which is their gorgeous outdoor patio area that we had extended for them that goes directly into their pool. One of my favorite features of doing an island like this with the cooking space in the island versus a sink is that once you're done cooking, the island becomes beautiful again. One thing that you'll notice about this kitchen is the appliances are a feature of the kitchen. That is purposeful because when you have a client that chooses monogram and Bertazzoni appliances, you make them that statement. We enhance those by putting built-in cabinetry all around them so they actually look bigger and taller when you're in the space. You'll probably notice that in this kitchen, there isn't a lot of perimeter countertop space. So we enhanced some built-in shelves and painted them the same color as the cabinets. And then we also added open bookshelves so she could put all of her cooking books and decorative items there without taking away or cluttering the kitchen. Another really awesome feature of this kitchen, on the back wall, we turned it into a desk office space, but it also is a continuation of the kitchen. So we used the same cabinetry to give her husband a really great desk area, and we brought the cabinets all the way down to the countertop, but we made it a little bit of a, a different feature by using a custom wood top so they can use it for a little office area, but when they're entertaining, it can become the bar area or the overflow area for the extra food and things like that. I full heartedly trusted them with executing what my husband and I wanted to do with the house. I feel like it's my home. And I'm carrying on the tradition of, you know, having my family here, just enjoying life on a daily basis and doing it something that's so beautiful. There is just a sense of calmness in here. And I love that. And I really love to be at home. I am so proud of how the design came to fruition in this house. It enhances all of the original characteristics of the home and it flows beautifully. It's really a stunner. This is another home that I would want to live in myself. It's very unique. It's got so many features. I'm so happy that we were able to give all of these features. Uh, despite the challenges and the details that we work through, the client is thrilled and that's the number one reward.